raise the shield so we get protected, but just stay on stack there. Don't go outside of it, because if you go outside the shield, it's big owie. Um, then we go back to fighting the arms. Same thing, rinse and repeat. There will be a second shield and sword collection phase, and at the second time we go over to circle. All collect there. Um, wait for the walls to pass, and then we will return to arrow to hit as hard as we can. Um, and something, something, brain remembers need to keep a shield because of a clap. Um, and then, yeah. <laughs> then hit the hands again until he dies, basically. So I'll attempt to shield collect with you, maybe, Amina? Are you planning to do it too? Yes, I will do shields. If you want to do shields, it's good. And then I saw somebody had been doing... Somebody said something about swords. Um, I can sword. Cool. We can sword together. Wraith and... Jen, looks like, are sword collectors. Nice. I gotta be lazy. Cool. Um, food stuffs. Hold on a second. Did I miss anything major? I mean, we'll jump into it. It'll be fine. Yeah. yeah. It'll be all right. You just need to tell me when you'd like to use my shield versus yours, that kind of a thing. This is uh, the... I'll just drop power food real close so everybody can eat it. Power. Power. And I'll put heal over here. Does anybody need Condi? Is everybody on power? No. Power flow at 30%. Okay. Rerouting. Um. I think, um. If you want to hold your shield, I'll use it first, and then you can use it. Okay, good strategy. I don't often get the full thing. But I'll try. Cool. I'm gonna go with that. Is anyone, any, or either of our uh, Vindies bringing roads by chance? I or am. Okay. Oh yeah, and then Jen is on Harold too. So is it stab like right away, or is there yeah. a bit delay? Yeah, there's like one second and slam. Okay. So as I'll soon as the aggro's, you can put down some roads. Sounds like we have lots of roads. Here we go. Yeah, it's roads. Yeah. Dude. Hit the uh, swords, make them go away. Oops, missed that. Go <laughs> ahead and make sure we're. We have a warrior, we have a warrior. Why? Oh. Because we didn't. Conjured um, one. You can't let them touch or they combine. Yeah. We need a collection. I phase. understand. I thought at first you would ask. Someone has a sword. sword. Okay. Awesome. Oh, gosh. Oh. We're missing. Definitely started on the wrong side before. I have a shield. You have a sword right now, Nina. You know. oh, there we I'm, go. Now I, you can. Yeah. No, I screwed that up big time. I do uh, not have a shield. I recommend restarting. Yeah. Just GG. My bad. I ran to the wrong side. Zael, are you bringing Spectral Grasp? Thank you. Sorry, I don't know if you have an available slot for it, but if you bring Spectral Grasp, that'd be good too. I don't really. Okay. Right. 
Do I have a pole? I don't think I do. Val's asking a question. Um, oh yeah, sorry. Spectral <laughs> grasp is mainly to, so it's to pull the swords in because the swords don't have a CC bar, so we can pull them. We can just pull them in right when they land, and then you just cleave them down, um, into like right in the middle of the stack. And then for shields, yeah, it can also be good for for CCing because it would CC all of them around you. But I would say prioritize pulling swords. It would be then we'll be able to have more time to kill shields because we don't have to worry about a warrior happening. I actually don't know about that. If chilled to the bone is AOE, then yeah, sure. Yeah, it is. Yeah, do it. It is. It's that'll nice. Be, that'll be good. Okay, pull. Not me doing that first pull without a utility. Yeah. Try to save swords until the fist lands, and then you can angle it on both the shields and the fist as soon as it lands. Shit, I just ate some of that power food. There's still heal food over here. Oh, good. All right, get ready for collection. There we go. Get to the correct side this time. Cool. Oh, sword. Grab your friends. I will use shield. this shield. Hit him as hard as you can. Nice. Phased. Stab. And this hand. Same thing. Let's kill the grass. swords. Ready for another collection phase in a moment. Not quite. Yeah. Yeah. By my will. No, get rid of that. Now. And then this time we will be going to circle. Someone has a here all sword. When the when oh. the hell that? If oh. the thing is bubbled and you're collecting swords, that's a really nice if you throw a sword at it so we can keep DPSing. Oh gosh. Uh, go to circle. Run. run, run, run. Mm. Oh, oh, you're running. Back. Shield. Well, we can uh, GG since we lost yeah. half the squad. Also, when the shield is up, you want to stop DPS because he's like reflecting it back at you. I'm pretty sure. I forgot to move the circle. No worries. Whoops. Dismounted from my mount in the middle of the air. Oh, that's interesting. About Shield to the Bone. Where? Defense, then offense. Hope oh, no one can hear me eating. It's very sad. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. 
Good. Noise gate saves me again. <laughs> Can you guys always hear my keyboard? No. Okay. No, no. Not always. I also keep almost everybody's volumes at like 50%, so. I can't do that. I gotta have everybody allowed. That audio processing issues, though. Might makes me right. Dodge or stab. <laughs> Whoops, shoot. Oh, hey, the yep. Alright. Oh, collection phase has started. Pick them back up in this direction. If you end Ooh. up getting your full ten swords, go ahead and uh, you can use it mid collection. No pain. And then the other person collecting the ten swords can do the second one. Bonk the boy. Big bonks, yeah. Oh, man, it's so close. You will obey. So we're pulling in these swords to kill them. Ready. We're almost at collection phase, not quite. Yeah, try to hold on to that sword. Now and it's... collection. I'll use a sword. And to circle. Keep bonking if you can on the way. You might be able to phase it. Are you using your shield first? Yes. Nothing can nice. Do we stay or do we go back to we center? Can, we just need to be good together. Whatever we're doing. Okay. Shield. Nice. There we go. Whichever one slams first. Collection phase will happen pretty soon here, as soon as we kill this arm. Almost. Kill the arm. Do we get it? Yes. Uh, yes. Okay, collection, collection phase. Stop. Stop hitting. Does anyone have a sword? No, I used it, but it didn't work for some Shields. reason. There we go. Nice! Good job. I know, I fell down there too. <laughs> You're not bolted at the same time. I'll have to make the next challenge more That's interesting. Funny. Oh, Boo is saying and they can hear my keyboard like 70% of the time. Have I missed anything? <laughs> of course, it's 
I like the 66 copper with the 4 gold. It's gonna... Yeah. Really keep me on top of things. Okay, boo, so you hear my keyboard noises only when you're listening to me on Twitch, not, like, in Discord? There it is. Uh, if you don't have a jackal, I think you just need to wait till we get through and then take the ley line. You can GG now, and you use the mm. ley line, or the ley lift to the bacterial ley vaginosis. Lift, yeah. The what, what what did someone else call it? It was like the Wait, what? Abyssal vagina, but it wasn't abyssal. It was like <laughs> Eldritch. Eldritch vagina. <laughs> oh that one. I told him to shut up and move on. <laughs> okay, I thought that was you, Ren. Okay, just follow the scrits. Ooh. We'll probably switch to Vert or Argos if that's okay. Yeah, I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm amazing. For anyone that. Oh, to be clear, I meant my. I was saying I would, but if you are too, that's great. <laughs> yeah, anyone? I was just saying, like, I think it's a much easier one. If anyone's staying That's power, right. you can go to left side, and that guy is actually more vulnerable to power. I can do it. Um, like, I'd I, like to go to that side as power well. Power and Chrono and Condivert aren't that different in terms of ranged effectiveness, I don't know. Yeah. So. Yeah, power kind of feel like is like the only power build that's actually like pretty easily ranged. Yeah. I need to learn power chrono. I need it's to It's so learn much fun. I love it. I was able to start to get to know it from I started with heal chrono and then boon chrono. If you're familiar with power virtuoso, it's not that different. I actually haven't really done Power Virtuoso. I have the gear for it. Oh, shoot. Then I tried it and I, it felt clunky to me. Is this one we're supposed to go through? Oh, yeah. Uh, it, yeah, it was right and right, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, Ren's volunteering with Snokos now. Yeah. Nice. Uh, I'd love to see it. Especially for something that I know you're sleeping. About why are you doing this? Which is accessibility for people. Bam. So you see this bitch. There we go. Big box. Oh no. Getting healthier. Oh, there you go. You're back, CC. Dead. Yay. Script by running over here. Are they? Or are they going that way? Yeah, we go this way. Hey, any problems? No. What is this? Okay. Well, if you think it's charming, then I guess I'll leave it. Um. Sorry, do you have a preference on which uh, primary or secondary tank? Secondary, please. Okay, so you will go to the right then? Yep. Cool. Um, quick, shitty explainer for this one. Uh, we fight the twin Largos. Um, we will start everybody on this first platform that is right in front of us. Fighting Nikari, uh, I think, or no, uh, okay. whatever. First, it doesn't matter. I think we'll fight one of them. But yeah, um, <laughs> the one that's on the oh. left. Sorry, the one I heard that a goes dog getting on a counter. Um, as we go, there will be one person gets um, 
selected, is it one or two people at a time, get selected, you get an AOE that follows you, and you want to take that away from the group, preferably to this side of the platform, oh, so the pull. side of the platform closest to where we we're starting here, uh, because when it drops, it will leave a field that will spread, sort of like the poison fields on Sloth. Um, yeah, the side with arrow. On that. Um, you want to put it basically like. So if you see you. the red AOE on you, make sure that you run to to arrow and drop that field. Um, he will also do whirlpools, I think, or a, a shockwave. You know. Do you it's want me to? I can go over this one if you want. <laughs> sure. Okay. Um, yeah, so the first person we fight is Nakare, who's also the guy who's going to be on the left. And then we're going to fight his sister, Canute, on the second platform behind him. And then split off to the right. It basically happens at health percentages. So when we get this guy to 50% health, we'll move to the platform behind him. Then when we get his sister to 50% health, we split and sub one, I guess, is going to go left and fight the dude. And then sub two is going to go right and fight the lady. Um, once we get them to 25%, then we go back one more platform to those platforms at the very end. Um, yeah, Nakari's mechanics are tidal pool, which is the thing that you want to you want to drop it towards the back side of the platform. Basically, you, on the sides where we're not trying to later need to jump off the platform and move to the next one, because the tidal pools slowly expand over time, and if they cover up that side of the platform, then you're gonna take a bunch of damage while you're trying to move to the next platform. Uh, the first mechanic in Nakari's attack chain that he will do is. Well, he'll do some, like, auto attacks or whatever, but then he will do, um, uh, he'll do a, a bubbles attack where everyone will get a little circle underneath their feet and you just want to move off of it after you hear it. I think it makes a boop boop sound as well. Um, if you are still in the AoE when it goes off, you'll float up in the air in a bubble, basically, and, um, not, you'll be, like, CC'd, essentially. So stun breaks can get you out of it. Um, Nakari will also do an attack that's two large uh, AoEs, and those just do a knockback if you're standing in them. Uh, lastly, he does a, a series of three dashes around the platform. The first time, he will go to the person farthest from him, then he will go to the tank, and then he will go to the person farthest from him when he is at that point again, and then he'll walk back to the tank. Um, since there will technically be two tanks in this, uh, the tank on both the first and second platforms is whoever has the highest toughness. They will be primary tank. Um, yeah, I think this is all his shit. Okay, so then we go to the... Uh, sorry, like Whisper of Jormag. The bubbles? Um, they're more like Bone Skinner in the sense that they're at your feet. It's not a knock-up where you can glide. You, f you float. It's like th like if you've ever been CC'd, a skill that does float, like Time Warp or something. Yeah, or Harb Fear. It's like that. But you're also in a bubble. Yeah. So a stun break can get you out of it, though. Yeah. Um, the second platform, we fight a sister who's going to have a bunch of, like, swirly water tornadoes, like, going around the platform. Whoever is tank, um, generally, they're the primary tank. Uh, oh, okay, so Amina's primary. Amina, you'll just kind of want to follow, like, the last tornado, because they go in, like, a slow clockwise fashion. So if you, like, follow the last one, then usually we don't get run over by them. Um, yeah, I know how to do the fight. It's just trying to remember everything to explain it to somebody who doesn't. Okay, yeah. the struggle. Um, so then uh, she has a series of attacks where... She will dash. She'll like blink to whoever's farthest from her. So, has someone kited before? I think Eve has kited before, right? Or does someone want to kite? I can kite. Okay, sure. So, Tracy will kite. Basically, she te teleports away and then does an attack that gives her a shit ton of boons. She'll like steal your boons. Um, so, we don't want to be in that AoE when that happens. So, 
that's why Tracy is going to basically just bait her off the stack and then quickly move out of her AoE. But if you find yourself accidentally in that little rectangular AoE, get out of it. Um, then she will do either an attack that does some like random AoEs around us that don't really matter, or um, a shock or a, a yeah shock wave. And on that one, you want to jump over the shock wave because it does give her a buff. I think if you get hit by it, even if it's, you have stab, um, I can help call out the timing for that if you want, Amina. Up to you. <laughs> okay. Um, I think that's basically all her shit. And then on the sides, we also will have CC phases. So you'll need to CC them in the middle. Um, last platform, they start to do a lot of extra damage. So just keep that in mind. We want to try to kill them at approximately the same time. Where I'm down. Should I bring extra CC? It's not, uh, not a bad idea. Uh, I think me and Eve should search subs since someone's going left. You're both DPS, right? I believe so, yeah. Okay. Just left then, is power. Yeah. Okay. Le yeah, left power, right. Nice, we've got like basically all the power people going left too. That's great. Forgot I have to do the ready check. Yeah. Oh yeah, and you just glide over these tornadoes, these water tornado things, and they'll launch you. If you fall in the water, I don't know if you, sorry if you said that, but... Oh, I didn't. If you fall in the water, head over to one of the water spouts and it'll pop you back up. Don't stay in the water too long. It hurts. Yeah. Also, running through Canute's tornadoes is a bad time. Try not to get run over by them. Don't stand in that. It's get SAB out, time. get out. And when we boy. Or when we're gliding over to a new platform, you should let the tank land first. Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, sorry, a hat. Sorry. Uh. Uh. Oh, hat. Okay. Now the birds are following me because it's purple. <laughs> you want a different color? No, I don't care. I'm just joking. They're all in my group, so it's great. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you got a lot of verts. Vert party. Vert train. <laughs> <laughs> it's raining verts. <laughs> Hallelujah. It's rain. Are you ready, Jen? There we go. More like it's raining blades. Sorry, I didn't let you right in first. There you go. Try too hard. Stay on his butt as usual. Will be embarrassing enough Bubbles you. off. Oops. I did not get off. One dash, two dash, one more dash. Those are knockbacks. Uh, sorry about tank. the whirlpool placement. Oh, that's not too bad. Right. That'll be all right. Yeah, uh, my mouth is on my other Warpools. screen. Oh, Things getting a dash soon. One dash, dash to tank, dash to farthest again, back to tank. All right. Spin around, bud. Bubbles soon. Oh, watch out. There we go. Sway. Bubbles. Bubbles. One dash, two dash, three dash, back to tank. Nice job placing those over to the side. Oh, oh, didn't quite get out of that one. Bubbles. Bubbles. Farthest. Walk to tank. Whoops. I got knocked off. Okay, he'll go to Saria for now then. Oh, we phase. I'm kidding. Oh, okay. Be <laughs> <laughs> over there. Alright. 
Sorry about that. Nice bait. Jump. Uh, jump. The oh, closer shit. together you guys are to her, the easier it is to kite. Alright, I'm back. Alright. Oh, Kiting. Keep moving, keep moving, keep Coming moving. Back to tank. Jump. Jump. Random AoEs. Moving, watch out. We gotta keep it moving. Going back to the tank. Jump. Jump. Shit. I keep going into a different skill when she does that. <laughs> and I cannot jump. Fortunate. About to phase her. There we go. Go to your sides. Two follows are you? Yeah. I guess we didn't think Mark about markers on that point before we told me. <laughs> Did everybody make it over at least? Oh, yeah, shit. but I was in first. It's okay. It's, it'll be okay. Knockbacks. Oops. CC. CC. Nice. Bubbles. Shit. Not back. Oh. Watch out, not back. Getting healthy. Yeah, if you gotta get Bubbles. closer, girl. Raise your friends. Watch out for the knockback, which I didn't Oh my missed. god. CC. It's closer. Oh Bubbles. lord. Phase two. All right. 25. How you guys doing? Thanks. Nice. nice. I thought I set down a trap, I did not. Bubbles. Bubbles. Knock back. Res. Not my dumbass thinking I was out of heal skills forgetting that I had a tone too. <laughs> CC. Where and down. Oops. Bubbles. Bubbles. Ah, fuck. As you can. Coming, coming. We're at seven, six percent. Thank you for the stun break. Shit. Get closer 5%. to her. Chick, stop breaking the couch. Um, Fuck. CC. Nice. Come to our platform. We're almost done here. Jet. One. Five seconds. Down state. Yeah, come on. GPS. Oh my god. Wow. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> so close. It's pretty good, though. Yeah. Pretty good. Try very close. 
And then uh, this will be oh, seven. Yeah, I got it. You know, flown over to the next platform right in all the tidal pool stuff. So Aww. no chance. To yeah. Live. To not okay. the platform. I think I'll just have to mark the platforms when I get over there. Yeah, we can't reach them. One of us will try to mark it. Oh, that's true. Hold on. Pop. Gross. Proximate. There you go. Everybody did, I mean, everybody was alive uh, all the way up until the last 1% on our platform, and I looked like health uh, on the other team's platform was pretty good, so. I, I died a little early. If I didn't die, I think we would have gotten it. I'm sorry. <laughs> eh. All good. Fine. I was, uh, just standing in all the knockbacks, so no worries. Doopadoo, -doo, hanging out. Going for a swim. Don't try what? too hard. This will be embarrassing enough Bubbles. Bubbles. No, get the end. Uh, you didn't hear me saying, "Fuck, fuck, which way the south?" Fuck. Uh, what? I had the AOE spread. So oh. I'm sorry if I missed it. Let me put a marker over there again. Okay, I thought we had one. Bubbles. Oh, I moved it for. Sorry, turn him. I probably put mine in the wrong place. All right. No, Dodge. it's not good. That can be the bubbles. outer edge bubbles. Oh, come on. At least now I know where to go. Come here, bub. Yeah, that's great to park, park him on the edge like that. Bubbles. Oh shit. There we go, phased. Rest, brother. You're the only one getting embarrassed now. Oh, no, I put one there. Alright, watch out for the tornadoes. I'm moving her. Fuck. Boom strip if you can. I'm trying to kite, but it's hard. I know, Jump. I'm sorry, I was in a bad spot earlier, so I think I... Everybody... Come move in. Okay, jump, jump holy next. Get ready to jump now. Teleport. Just coming back to tank. Thank you. Jump will be next. Jump. Jump. I'll say as I go into the water. <laughs> Whoa! She blinked away as soon as I used the leap skill, so I too went in the water. Okay, go All to right. the side. Sub one to arrow. Sub two to not arrow. Soikle. Soikle. Bubbles. Not back. CC. 
Oh, I'm murdered. Oh no. If someone else is able to kite in place of Tracy, like Eve, do, I think you do know how, right? I think I've had you kite before. Anyway. Shit. That was really weird. Like, I was like, I had like half my downstate left and then just murdered. Might have been water stacks? I don't know. Might have. Pebbles. Yeah, watch out. Ah, fuck. CC. Bubbles. Bubbles. Almost to... phased. And phased. Okay. Uh, I don't think I can get over to the other side to help them. The other side's probably gonna submerge. Yeah. Defense, then offense. What's it phase at 25? Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, we're done. Yeah. yeah. No worries. You were down a person, so. Yeah. Any questions? Amina, if it's easy for you, if you could follow him on his last dash, so then he doesn't go really far <laughs> and stays in one place more when he walks back to you. Okay. I think you could technically, if you wanted to, you could follow him on his first dash, because he'll just go to you. Like, you could... You could position yourself so that when he does his second dash, he doesn't go through anyone. If you wanted to play around with that. Okay. <clears throat> People are on their own for the first and the third dash, though. I guess, the, and then the walk back is the other one. Don't try too hard. This will be embarrassing enough for you. Bubbles. Bubbles. Oops. Yeah. <laughs> Knock back. Knock back. Oh, uh, place the. Oops. Bubbles. All right, we're gonna have to shift a bit. Um, for now, place your oh gosh, <laughs> place them on the other side of the platform to where we are now. So, like, don't go straight to square because we're gonna have to fight around square. The jump. tornadoes jump. Top. 
teleport in, and then she'll walk back, and then I think she's going to do the jump next. No, she's doing that. Hey, okay, yeah. so now it's getting me jump. Jump. Wait, split? Mm. Bubbles. Oh, I've got a title for I did that. Don't move him away. CC. Bubbles. Bubbles. Fish ran out of my trap. Watch out for the knockback. Oops. Hey there, friendo. Bubbles. Oh shit. Bubbles. CC. Knock back. Thank you for the stab. Time to let loose. The and phase. Nice. How you guys doing? Just we already fixed. Nice. We already fixed. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I should have said it like that. <laughs> 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 Bubbles. God, why do I keep getting this fucking tide pool? Uh, knock back, watch out. Time to let loose. Knock back. Bless you for keeping him fairly still. As still as he can be. <laughs> Bubbles. Yeah. CC? And they're not back. Right. All of the time. We're at 9%. 12. And you're at 12. 11. Fuck. Do you want to send someone over? We're at 9, 8. Bubbles. Okay. Yeah, I think we'll be okay. 6. E. Knock back. I greet it. One. Yeah. Nice! Woo! Way to go. Yay! Ooh. I think I get a log. Oh, nice! Yeah. Cool. Sadly, I fell in at one point, so I didn't get that achievement. But I got the other one. <laughs> you have to remind I, my me. My computer lagged so much. Yeah, no worries. Uh, this is advanced raids. Do we want to try Kadim, or do we want to go clear Hi, some dude. more things and get gold and stuff? I mean, I'm down for practicing some Kadim, so I could practice no Kiter, no but I'm also fine with. I mean, I'm just here to fill. So whatever you guys want to do. Then lead the way. Um, All right. Yeah, I think there's something in his room I'm supposed to collect. But, you know, we'll be back. So I don't care. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if we'll clear him. I mean, we could give it a couple pulls and then move on if uh, it's not looking good. Just a reminder, we've done it with three healers usually. But, I don't know. Uh, that's QTP. This is... Oh, right. Kadeem. Yeah. You guys good for trying a couple pulls? No. 
These doors are fake. <laughs> I'm offended. They shouldn't be fake. Which doors? Oh, that the you're... doors we just went through. Yeah. Alright. Oh, fuck. Ah. We will need uh, two people to go down. I know Eve has gone down in the past. God damn it, I keep doing my untamed rotation. If this turns into just a one pool thing, that's okay. Yeah. Q1 refresh. You can give a quick overview if you want, I mean, no. Uh, probably best. Okay. Uh, we're gonna have friends who are gonna be going down to the lamp and doing lamp things. You don't need to worry about what they're doing. Just worry about not hitting the lamp until they say to hit it. Lamp is in the center of the arena. Um, while they are down dealing with the lamp, uh, we are going to be fighting various creatures up top. Initially, it's going to be um, a hydra. Make sure you are not standing in the hitbox, because that is how the tank is decided. Um, CC quickly when it happens. Um, there is an attack chain pattern to when the CC happens, and I, I mean, do you remember it? Uh, bite, bite. Bite, bite, Something. Breath. Yeah. Bite, bite, <laughs> CC, I think. So, yeah, bye bye, Fritz. Bye bye, CC. Yeah, so just have your CC ready to big bonk um, at that time. And I'm sure, I mean, I can like do those calls and stuff. Um, yeah. And then. You gotta precast that CC. Yeah. Uh, highly recommend, yeah, precasting CC. So then. Once the lampers are ready, they will say, hey, lamp time. We'll kill the lamp, they come back up, they bring a creature up that kills the rest of the HP on whatever we're actively fighting. <clears throat> um, mm -mm, what do I do here? I guess that there. I think that there. Yeah, approximately. Okay. The in-between phases that we do. So here's here's how the phasing goes. Fight a boy while our friends are in the lamp. Kill some pyres. Fight Kadeem. And then you just rinse and repeat that. For t two cycles. So, well, a total of three cycles. The first, including the first one. So we'll fight a Hydra. And then we'll fight a Magma Elemental. For the Magma Elemental, you want everyone stack in the middle at the start of it and CC like immediately and then back out and let the tank have aggro. Um, the third time you will go actually over here and you will end up fighting um, a Hydra. We will need someone to mat tank during that. Um, someone comfy with doing that? I'm probably gonna be kiting so I cannot. What do you mean by mat tank? So, there will be a matriarch two and a matriarch. Mm -hmm. Two wave ah, okay. And 
Amina will be tanking Patriarch. I need someone to tank Matriarch in the meantime. We'll basically yeah, be there by yourself and just, just dodging just... attacks. Mm -hmm. I can do that. Okay. She has a fairly predictable attack chain. <clears throat> Um, maybe bring a stun stun break with you so you can get used to how it goes because I don't remember the exact pattern but she does like a smash which is a knockback. She has a telegraphed attack which obviously you just step out of that one. Um, and she has that swipe. wing attack at some point. Just step into like the back side of her hitbox to avoid that. I think she does a swipe as well and that will would be a knockback. I would be kiting, yeah. Um, okay, so. And I think it's once you get Patriarch down to like 75% health or 70 or something, then you can move over to Matriarch. Um. Yeah. And then we do some like hopping around and stuff. Uh, don't worry about it until we get there, I guess. <laughs> uh. <laughs> the part where we do the pylon, the, or the, yeah, the pylons that you kill. Uh, sub- one, I guess. Might makes me right. No, because how's the kiter be easier over there? Okay, so sub two, you're gonna be going to arrow. So it's actually the first time I think there's like a little enemy that spawns right here. You kill them, and then um, you hop over to this platform and kill a pyre. And then the second time, it's actually over here. So that's why the marker is kind of like in between them. Same thing with the other one. I mean, you can also just, like... Where do you want me to place prod? Oh, the port. 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 Um, right... Here, I think? I, oh, yeah, yeah, I was asking if you wanted me to bring... Okay. Oh, yeah, you can do it. Mm -hmm. Feel free. <laughs> so... Nice. Sub one, then. Because sub one, we're going to yeah, be going up to circle. We'll have a port, which will be very nice. Um... GC, if you want to practice taking a port for your group, you're welcome to. There is some stuff that happens at the end, some shenanigans with ports, but I'm not really sure how it works. But for the part where you're doing the pyres, you would just go over here and you'd place, um, you'd place your portal on, like, square. And then go over to the, the pylon thing and jump over and, and hit it and stuff. Um, I think that's everything. Oh, the slubs. Um, right, so when we're fighting Kadeem in the middle, he has fire under his feet and it's owie, don't stand in it. He does a knockback, that is very owie. Uh, we can stab it, but it hurts, so try to jump it. Try to dodge it. Um, there also will slowly be, when he first spawns, um, uh, like, magma earth elemental guy, slowly walking towards him with three little slublings in tow. We want to pull those earth boys like together and away from the slublings um, because they're protecting them and we want to kill the slublings because if they reach Kadeem then he gets a bunch of stacks and then I personally have a very bad time as the kiter. Um, so still good to keep Spectral Grasp here for pulling them in. Um, temporal Curtain's good to have around as well. Um, yeah. Uh, I was going to place more food, but I'm not seeing Hondi food. Are we out? We might be, or I'm blind, because I don't even see it when I mouse over the other things, so mm -hmm. could be blind. No, we have some. Quickly. Uh, this is, is a power preferred fight, because we won't be stripping his resolution boon. So he will be having resolution the entire time. Okay, sub two, no port for you. Sorry. Unless, unless Saria is able to port across the jump or something. I don't think it reaches that far. It won't go across gaps Aww. at all. So. That's too bad. Sorry. I'll get my power thrown together. We should just do that. 
<laughs> what am I doing? That's not the build I want. There we go. I think I'm ready? Question mark. Yeah, I mean, I feel like <laughs> maybe two pulls of this and they'll yeah, be done. Right. I'm doing okay, B. Oh yeah, who's doing lamp? Eve, are you good to do lamp? Probably want one other person with her. I would assume. And we need someone to stab for lamp three. Unless you can stab for yourself. You want to take GC the lamp with you? Have a dual Vindy lamp? Just follow Eve around. Okay. Um. Jen, are you. you do you have Jalus? We just need someone to, yeah, go down there and give stab to them on lamp three if we make it there. On the phone, as in, like, phone hotspot? Oh. Oh, I guess you don't need to go down there. It looks like GC's gonna bring Jalice. Okay. Not going. Okay. <laughs> oh, you want me to do another one? Sorry. That's okay. A water boy. Why am I... What's going on? Yeah, that was weird. How did I not kill any of them? Oh my god, what's happening? I was not paying attention. <laughs> uh, can we? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so you Someone's gonna have to yell at me when it's lamp time, so I know to follow you. Okay. Like, I was standing in the normal spot to start the fight, and then all of a sudden I was in the lamp. I don't know what happened. <laughs> Well, Eve did say lamp is going to be hard because she doesn't have a way to look at the path. So. Yeah, but I was like, I was standing right here, and then I don't know how I got in the lamp from here. It I looks like just then. In the lamp too, so not that time. You basically, uh -huh. um, Eve, for the lamp, you just want to go for the easiest enemies, essentially. If Eve doesn't want to do it, I can do lamps. Okay. On purpose. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Tracy sure. and GC lamping. Oh. Maybe so, I, is GC doing first lamp and second lamp, or am I doing first lamp and second lamp? You're both doing all lamps. Both doing all, okay. Yeah. Uh, Tracy, can I follow you, or should I have a diagram pulled up just in case? I have a uh, wish HUD, so I should be able to see the path. I, is it just the regular pathing one? Mm-hmm. What do you mean? Which uh, add-on overlay is it? Um, I think it's the timers, actually. Ah. Pull. Okay, yeah. should I pull? Well, uh, second, sorry. I'll do one more. Okay. Thank you. Where's Lancey? Oh, 
Oh, he's in his house. Oh, he seems to be going in there because Pachi keeps going in his clubhouse. <clears throat> I don't know how to keep her out of there. Okay. Sorry. Ooh, tattoo itchy face, huh, Jen? Get some okay. ice, I guess? Oh, <laughs> Wendy. always gets me. I don't know why. Yeah. I'm amazing. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah. Wait. I got I got gank. Get ready to CC CC. Quickly. Nice. Ow. 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 I need help. My buddy oh. wasn't with Can me. Can someone go a res? Is it lamp time? It was at the start of a fight, GC. I don't know how lamp works. I said someone needs to yell at me. <laughs> oh, I didn't catch that part. Ugh. It's okay. We had a many change of plans at the last minute there. Oh, yeah, this uh, looks like another. So... Yeah, let's just All do me, And I will go straight for the lamp. But okay. I don't know when it happens. Yeah. It starts before the fight does. We are the start of the fight right when the kite pulls. Oh. Mm -hmm. So yeah, the lamp the works here. Once the green circle in the middle of the platform appears, you want to be in it. Quickly. Okay, I am so sorry about that. Oh good. I just, no worries. It's been years since I've done this fight, and I kind of accidentally ended up in a lamp once, and that's apparently. <laughs> GC, GC over here. I stretch. Tracy, okay. do you want a hat? Would that help? Uh, I don't know. I will follow the pretty wings. Don't no. worry. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay. Yes, I am very pretty. You're like the fairy princess Silvari, and I'm like the dark devil Silvari. <laughs> <laughs> I'm literally Tinkerbell. Oh my god, you are! I'm so dense! I'm sorry! <laughs> <laughs> That's adorable! It's a shame I can't use mini tonic during raid. Right. I wish I could use them okay. beginning. Okay, I'm with you now. We go together. Actually, you know or hopefully light. Right here. This way, left. Oh, hi, Ren. <laughs> That's how I do it. This way, forward. Nah, I'm sorry. Getting it back. Okay. Get ready to CC. CC. Yeah. Oh my god, what is with these coding? Yeah, I got deleted as well. Okay, he's teleporting. I got hit by a meteor okay. from the CC. Coden might not be the right path. I might be picking the wrong path because my I markers usually... are showing that way. But... I got teleported. Yeah, I usually don't get no. Coden. Yeah, the, the markers are showing that, but that might, for some reason, it might be only like showing me markers path. for three. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, the right. enabled only tells me CC timer. It doesn't tell me where to go. So, but I'll follow you if okay. we do this. Let's, also, I think let's do a different wing. Behind the Hydra. <laughs> yeah, well, let's just, I'm, my brain is not um, together enough for this, so That's let's fine. go do something else. Why can I not move? Wing four is the wing I like to do when I my brain feels like doing much. But I don't know how other people feel. That's how I feel about wing four. Yeah, wing four easy peasy. Something is like really weird with my load right now, cause like I can't move. The fuck? Teleport to aerodrome. Yeah, I'm like stuck here. Weird. Help. I'm moving? Where am I even? I'm still in, in the aerodrome. Are you DC'd? I am still. I'm just stuck underneath the waypoint. No, you're over by uh, the ramp to Wing 4. Yeah. Oh, you just disappeared. Yeah, I teleported <laughs> out because I like couldn't move. Now I can move. Alright, Wing 4, or I saw we have a Gates instant, so we could do Wing 7 fast too. Ooh, or we seven. could do both. There we go. I'm no longer stuck. 
Yeah, I agree with Ren. Either sounds fun to me, actually. Okay. Let's start with four. I <laughs> had six oh, gold so and like 66 silver and the trading post. Oh no, someone has a great. Sorry. There you are. Now that you're here, we can explore this Great. place. I see someone's a bit impatient. You think there's Uh, somebody want to babysit Glenna? Isn't it obvious? I make a discovery, I'm going to investigate the heck out of okay. it and wait till you see what I found. Thank Where you. Exactly Good question. I don't know, but the answer is most certainly around us somewhere. Should I bring staff for this? The... Yeah. For all yeah. the greens. Yeah. That's what I figured. Um, does everyone have to do greens, or just... Just Wraith. Okay. Then we could bring Stab, and you can try it. If you fail, we can reset once or twice, and then we can just continue. Oh, don't worry about reset. I'll just try my best. Well, you'll need some people to go with you for the ones that, uh... Require more than one person. Yeah, if some people could maybe help, that'd be nice. But I don't want to like you look or anything. I don't mind. <clears throat> I'm gonna give you a hat so we know which uh, screen you're in. Nice. Yes. Clear to start. Lead the way. Takes her a thousand years to walk down here anyway. <laughs> Hi. I'm on uh, episode four of Game Changer, the murder mystery, and I can't help but be like, you guys are asking the wrong question. <laughs> they keep talking about the murder being in the script. Why are you not looking harder at the script writer? <laughs> Is that the new one? No, it's, it's season one, episode four. I'm oh, at the beginning. Yeah. Oh, wow. We watched like some of them, but only some of them. Did you see that? We loaded a bowl and smoked it. Defense, then off. <laughs> oh yeah, GC. I managed to load the bowl really fast. Whoops, doesn't it? God damn it. Uh. I am something else today. These teleports are so obnoxious. I know. Green. Oh, uh, agony on stack. Thank you. Sorry, you're standing a little far out, unless you're. Might get hit by his purple things. Me? Or his yeah. Bro, oh no, it's greens. Is there a green in the middle? There's one in the middle, I think. Oh, Isn't there? I went to one over there. Sorry. I need help. Pound it into dust! Zale, if you park yourself on one of the markers, it'll probably be easier for you. Big time. We come to square. Getting healthier. Yeah, even if you have agony, like that's what those markers are for. We have the stack on arrow and then an agony 
person, so like GC go to circle when you can. Circle, yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to get over there, sorry. Oh, Just okay. pass the whole group. Ah. Getting help. Doesn't help when I teleport towards the group. And all right, I'll rotate to square. Somebody can stay on heart, and we need an agony on circle. Uh, agony on stack. You can oh. switch with me. Did you get credit? Mm, no, <laughs> not even close. <laughs> no. Well, good practice okay. anyway. Yeah. It's like being quite a I'm over here. On the way. So I definitely made an assumption that we were all aware, but typically where the markers are, the stack would stay on arrow, and then. The other three with Agony would stand on the other markers. And the actual marker placement puts you inside the ring where you will not get hit by the crystal shards that he spits out, which means you won't get knocked back all the way across the arena. So when you have Agony, you want to stand on whichever marker other than Arrow is not... What's on the other side? currently occupied by somebody with agony. So that would be either circle, square, or that doesn't sound whatever the other is. Um, yeah, because it keeps you inside of his, uh, some his spot and you won't get hit. And close enough that you can benefit from boons, but not so close that you will leave your agony on the sack. Why are you so fast? I don't know. Swiftness. You like Parma Swiftness. I am never fast though. Staff was like a crazy line coming out of it. Oh, it oh, yeah. stopped, but yeah, that was crazy. Need someone to take dispel. Is anybody comfortable with that? Or want to practice? This would be a good time to practice. Um, okay. Uh, do let me check. The fury is mine. Watch your surroundings. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> Forgot to remove stability. Oh. <laughs> oh, shit! <That's> okay. <laughs> oh, well. Slightly less beans. Why do I keep using my force movement skills? Why am I doing this? Make sure we're cleaving these boys down. Oh, sorry, I didn't have it targeted. I will target it next time. No. Not now. Getting help. Watch your feet. Chat for the spikes. Oh no. Hopefully, maybe. Uh move to heart. We'll have to move back to arrow. Yep. Back 
back to heart. Oh no, oh no. We got two Ooh. boys coming and three boys. Oh man. This is gonna be fun. Ready to use protect when they're about to die. Move to arrow, claim. I'm trying. Protect on group. Nice. Good save. I did not consider that I usually just spell on Vert. <laughs> so I'm able to cleave. Oh. <laughs> and I can just target the thing that's far away and attack and like leave it targeted, you know? That the thing that has the shield. Did anyone else does not help? Oh god, yeah. I did not realize we lost all of our verts and I was like the only one hitting <laughs> it. Okay. Yeah, I need more practice. I don't have any thieves. Okay. I can go grab a thief really fast. Oh, dear me. Actually, oh yeah, we need CC. I'll go get my vert. I could use my staff, but I don't want to staff in the spikes today. Well, I can pick this. Feel the fury. Okay. Eve, are you feeling like you can uh, bait target through here? Oh, she's saying I'll tank. Okay. Yeah, we have Sorry. to all be in the hitbox. No I was standing outside texting hitbox. and not reading the chat. How dare you. Yeah. Um... Cool, so yeah, everybody stand in the hitbox during the fight when possible. If you get knocked out or knocked away, try and get back as quick as you can. Particularly during the CC phase, um, just be like, up the butt. And then Eve can bait the next target. Let me switch this. Back to that. Uh, actually, let me do that. Do we have pushes for um, Brigham? Sorry, I'm big. Oh, yeah, Temporal Curtain would be good. Uh, Rayeth has Greatsword 5. Yep. If we struggle, I can switch to Druid. Okay. Cool. That's good. Watch out. I did, but Spirits no avail. Yeah. Uh, we can just see the uh, GG. Yeah. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> I was in my life. death my animation while I was getting flung away. That was entertaining. <laughs> I'm gonna just get Druid. But we didn't even make it to that. Yeah. <laughs> Tracy says, I have no faith. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, it I'm... just seemed like a good opportunity. <laughs> Do what you want. It's fine. Because then I have both uh, Glyph of Tides and all this above. 
I got Do we some... ever pass up an opportunity to flip each other's shit? No. <laughs> I got some good screens of Laref using the embiggening tonic and hanging out with Mommy Paytha today. <laughs> Mommy. I love her so much. Paytha's great. I ship her in the commander 100%. Yeah. <laughs> I was all all about, like, Frode was looking at Laref and stuff, but then Paytha showed up, so. Frode missed out. Mickey keeps fucking taking over Lancelot's little gentleman's club, his clubhouse, and then like he doesn't want to go in there and kick her out, so he has to sleep elsewhere, and then she doesn't hang out with me while I'm on the computer. Aww. Uh, Tracy, I think the ready check was yeah. There you go. I just got to the group. And jump. It's like holding a joint in my hand wall. I had, I had my hand on the mouse. <laughs> so... Jump. <laughs> CC. Stay in the hitbox. Nice. Watch out, swipe. CC. And jump. Swipe. Get ready to CC again. Stand in the hitbox. And get ready to phase, so stay out of the way. We'll knock down any of these spears in the meantime. Want to be about. Yeah, fish. Don't run out to Rigam. They aggro whoever's farthest from them, so. We come out. Get ready to start friends. Friends. And jump. CC stand in the hitbox. Again? Uh, friends. I'm sorry, I'm coming. I'm sorry. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I tried to dodge and then it dodged me the wrong way. Yeah. Uh, C, C stand in the hitbox. Very good. Right. Oh my god, again. <laughs> Just want to be friends. Well, I'm a melee class, and I oh. want to bonk. CC, stand in the hitbox. Get up in there. Getting Jump. And watch out for freeze. Oh, took the way. Oh, that was close. Oh, Ren. That's so sad. That was very rude, too. Yeah, same. GC and I, like, barely survived, but we were hit, like, the same length you were. No! Thank you. 
taking care of that spear. to CC again. Friends. <laughs> CC in the hitbox. Uh, more. There we go. Spooky. Good job. Sorry, I had the wrong thing. Oh, land. Oops. Oh, that makes sense. Oh, well. Sorry. <laughs> no worries. Ready to CC again. Is she singing a song for people, Ren? We heal as one. Of course she was. Okay, you oh. know what? This fucking morning, Lancelot threw up a hair tie. Do you see? <laughs> oh no! Oh my god. And Pete was like, where did he get that from? And uh, I was like, I don't fucking know. I feel like I haven't seen any of your hair ties around. Because I, like, I, it wasn't one of mine. I didn't leave any of mine out. Turns out he had like a pile of hair ties on the bathroom counter. That it was just, yeah, it Join was there. The <laughs> he had a stash. Yeah. One behavior. No more room. We love Lancey. Yeah. I like it. I get scared that my cats eat things that I don't know about. Same. they do that a lot. Gwen really likes to play with sticks. <laughs> or like specifically sticks or stick-like things. Like if I make spaghetti I always give her a raw spaghetti noodle because she loves those. <laughs> That's so funny. Um, do we... Outside on the porch. Zara, are you gonna hand kite? I could hand kite. Do you want to hand kite? Uh, I mean, if somebody else wants to hand kite, I'm fine with them doing it. But otherwise, sure. Can I tempest I'll do it. hand? Uh, I don't know if rebound would be up for every one of them. Yeah, but I could make more agent. Probably not enough. You could make there what? Is... There is um, an agent. There's agit. a couple skills that give you ages too. Not just rebound. That also isn't Aegis, but is some other kind of. Blood. Oh, does Aegis work for that? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Oh wait, what am I saying? Of course it does. I don't know what's going on with my brain. <laughs> Told me to throw but it. You know what it does not work for? Flame wall on Sabatha. Yeah. You know what does work for it? What the fuck is my? There's my hand kite build. <laughs> yes, I want that thing. To it is true that distortion works on Sabatha. But it also means you can't get bombed for your cannon. I chose you. I see no problem here. What's your <laughs> toughness? Sixteen twenty-eight. video of Guild Wars 2 is someone just standing still playing Virtuoso on Sabatha. <laughs> Not moving once the entire fight. It does work on the flame walls. It, it just does. also keeps you from it. getting cannoned. Yeah, it works it's on like, the flame wall. It's like the only thing that works on flame wall. Yeah. Okay. It threw Zoa off when I got my Sabbath a log. Or at least, <laughs> I don't know if that was the log that got it, or if it was one you just looked at, but... You, yeah, like, pinged me, and you were like, wow! Yeah. Does anyone want an oil kite? 
I mean, I don't mind oil kiting during the phases. Okay. Like, if someone yeah. goes down, I don't mind doing it. Oh, yeah, green walls are, are no-go. What are you doing? Go let them out! <laughs> Did you forget to take off stability again? Yeah. <laughs> um, I mean, it'll be good for the end. For the it's sanctuary, time. it's not stab. Oh, okay. Well, I think will still be good for the CC when Saul comes up. But no help for Condies. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, I don't know. He's uh, he's pretty fickle. Oh my god, me again. <laughs> he's a fickle lover. Take me down. Move him away from center so that when oils begin, which is now, uh, guys out of the way. Fuck, I'm dead. Oh, <laughs> you gonna come hang out with me? Hi, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, so is Deimos. I mean, I can tank, but someone else would have to hand kite, and I don't think we've got that option. <laughs> yeah, let's just... <laughs> GG. Just another chance for chains at the start. Yeah. Otherwise, that was going pretty smooth. <laughs> Next pool meaning this one. I think they mean the pull after. Yeah. For what it's worth, friend, CM and Deimos is just that each sub needs to have Aegis because there's no mind crush. That's really all you need to worry about. And then you just want to like DPS. Although I wouldn't recommend it since we don't have chains down efficiently right now. Yeah. Because that makes it harder. Do it. Here he comes. Nothing. 
stand in the ward. Quickly. In the ward. Sometimes I'm not sure if I'm actually in it. <laughs> it's hard to see. It is. Oops. Like, eh, uh, uh, close help, enough. Help, 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 help. Nope. Sorry. Ah, GG. I just, like, misjudged my footing. And had a toe and some hands. Nice try. And. I think we'll just stick to normal mode. Oh, I don't get to stay up and play Defense, with the pride. Then offense. Aww. He always slams to the west first. This one's still at like 80. I've got the target. Why were you just wailing on that chain? Yeah, why please? <laughs> Do we try to time them? Uh ideally try to just when get them all at, like, at once. You gotta like when they're Stop. at fifty percent, you check the other ones. Yeah. Watch out for that slam. Okay, no. Quickly. Defense, then offense. Yeah, you just have to check very frequently, especially if you're power. If you're power, you really gotta keep checking. Ideally, um, you want to get each chain slash statue down to like if you're on power 20 stop at 20 if you're on condi then stop at like 50 and then check all the other chains around you stand in the war quickly into him. The pain. We heal in one. Stand in the war. Quickly. I was, I was desperate. So I turned to see oh, to back. my creditors. Kill Saul. But, but I could not outrun my guilt. I was Shot caught in the crimes and exile. Nice. Oh god. Let's slide this way because we'll have oil starting shortly. And then I'll walk him around the other way. Alright, oil, don't step in it. We've got a tear tear. Good job avoiding that. Thank you for getting the tear. Another oil. Back to the center. He will follow me, so come towards me, not him. Because there's an oil on him. Good job. I need to head down. Oh my lord, that was close. <sighs> Well, I'm just gonna come back to the middle. <laughs> oh fuck! Shit! Oh shit! I'm down. Fuck. Ah. Oil. No oil. Center oil. Okay, stay to the outside. Can we? Oh, nah. Are we done? Uh, yeah, this is a GG. Yeah. That was unfortunate. Bad timing. Yeah, last pool magic. Or 
Ass pull mag magic. Ass pull. Don't pull anyone's ass, please. Without consent. <laughs> Sorry, guys, I was interrupted. I, ugh, my mates. Zale, you can always hit the little arrow, or if you have regular key, key binds, you can press P. Well, let's go. What are you doing? Defense, then Don't off. let him out. Let's try to get a a four chain. Keep an eye on those chains. Don't take them to zero if the others are still high. We're at 79, 145. We got a 93 over here. Hit that 93. Ooh, we got one that's about to pop. It's at like 2% with some condies. Another with 2% of condies. Ooh. Two down. Oh, I swore we were going to get three with that one because I think one of those is still at like 2%. Pick the one that's not at 2%. What? Oh, somebody stood on me. Oh. I didn't want to go down. Oh. <laughs> oh, really? It's gonna be me. Okay. It's the 2% that didn't get hit. Oh, rip her. Oh, gosh. <laughs> no worries. <laughs> Okay, I gotta get over there. Oh man, he put the banner over there though. Thank you. I was like, where do I start? And then like you put down the bow of truth where I normally stand. It's <laughs> like, oh okay, that's where I'm going. <laughs> that place. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mostly I can't see anything other than him, so I just Sometimes have to assume. Yeah. Thank you for the barrier. Sure. I can reach him with my staff. We heal the one. Stand in the war. Quickly. I was, I was desperate and turned to thievery to pay my creditors. But I could not outrun my guilt. I was caught for my crime. He us one. I, I was left for dead. Okay, shift him away. Oh, shoot. That is an oil right in the middle. Uh, if you have Aegis in sub 2. Oh gosh. There Use might it. End up being a sliver. Maybe. Yeah, there's a tiny oh. sliver of space on the side. Nice! Oh, nice. oh shoot! <laughs> oh fuck! No, nope, I'm down. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's alright. 
unfortunate. I do not understand my roommate sometimes. Uh, he said he was going to make smoothies. I'm like, okay. But then he went and did the thing that I keep telling him not to do, where he puts triple berry mix into mango juice, and it just does not work. <laughs> you mean flavor-wise? Or... Flavor-wise. Oh, yeah. We are at time. Yeah. Uh, I'm okay to end, unless you guys want to do one more pull, and we can try one more pull, but we can be done. Either way. I'm pretty tired. Me too. Sounds like people right. are tired. Cool. Well, thanks everybody for coming. Thanks for leading. So much yeah, gold. Yeah, thanks for leading. Yeah, thanks for the help. Yeah. Okay. Next week is Beginner Raids mm -hmm. with Ren, I think. Yes. So keep an eye out for that. I'll post signups now. What the fuck is next week? To... Hmm? It's the second. Uh, Thursday is, yes, the second. Yeah. Anyone wants to hear the saga of this? Uh dumpster fire on a derailed train that has gone so far off the rails it hit a ramp which sparked the rocket boosters underneath it which shot it into the moon your project right? project that's or heading straight into the project. sun Ugh. then i can tell you that story Ugh. yeah i'll hang out for that i'm clearing bags and stuff <laughs> oh i love bitching about work please tell me about it it is so bad uh, yeah, so, we have this group, they are DXP, don't ask me what it stands for, I don't know, but they do platform stuff, so things like Sitecore projects and that kind of thing. Ooh, that's a cool one. Um, and a long time ago, like in 2020, when all the theme park work dried up, um, it, they weren't DXP at the time, but I worked with this group of people um, on a couple SC Johnson websites for things. And um, it was bad then, in 2020, that I made recommendations to the person who was in charge of it of things they needed to change. And it was stuff like they had literally never asked the people who were doing the work to estimate how long it would take them to do the work. It was just executives making decisions on how long they had. And then, because they set these teams up and sold projects in with such few hours, so that was not enough to actually complete the work, they then told the team members to not bill their time, which meant they were hiding hours that they were you know actually incurring paying these people which meant their margins on projects were even worse than they appeared and they were already bad so like these were all problems in 2020 mm -hmm. and i got off that work like i don't give a shit about building websites i don't care uh like whatever a soap website is a soap website i'm here to do other cool shit well Two weeks ago, the guy, we've since reorged like three different times, but two weeks ago, the guy who runs my group were, asked me if I could go help this project that I had no information on, hadn't heard of it, whatever. He was asked by the managing director of our team, which is like executive, executive, so can't really say no to that. So much to do. I've been really unbillable recently because I don't have much work. They're laying people off, so sure. Whatever, I'll go do it. And they said, oh, you know, you're good. It should be like 50% of your time. And I said, I'm not going to commit to that. What I will do is spend a week evaluating what's going on, and then I will tell you how much of my time that you need. 
And oh my gosh, this is the worst project. I, there is nothing redeemable about this project. Mm -hmm. They have run it so far into the ground. It's awful. Big red. They're, it's the same group of people who destroyed the SC Johnson program. Like, we lost that client because they ran it so badly. Um, they lost another major client that we had, like, a month ago. Not even. Because uh, they ran that one so badly. Mm. And... If they don't lose this client, I will be shocked. And if they don't lose this client, I think we should fire the client because they're so bad. Um, there are... They initially bid on a Sitecore migration project, so just move the current website to new Sitecore platform. Yes. Bam, done. Client apparently took six weeks to get back to them, and then when they came back, they said, not only do we want you to do that migration, we want you to redesign the whole website, too. Should be great news, right? Awesome. More work. Actually get a creative team in here. All that stuff. Except this group of people has no idea how to do anything creative. So they once again... I don't know how they came up with the estimates. I don't know if they even did come up with estimates, to be honest. Because mm. I haven't seen them. And... The reason they called me in, the reason they gave, was, oh, well, the creative team has just been spinning, so we need somebody who's used to doing creative work to come help the team not spin anymore. But okay, well, let me see if that's true. No. What's happening is there is absolutely nobody managing this client. They are horrific. The main client stakeholder was described as abusive, and I have seen that, and seems like that's accurate. She rules via fear. Uh, another client stakeholder is toxic. He gaslights people. So he'll be on a call. He'll, he'll say yes to something. He'll get on the next call say, I never said that. Um, so client sucks. The main client stakeholder got a new boss like three weeks ago. Well, it's probably been a month at this point. He almost immediately identified her as a problem. So he started working around her directly to us, which pisses her off. So they're putting us in the middle of their political bullshit. So that's fun. But we have no client account manager. Nobody is helping this team communicate to the client. So our UX lead and our creative lead are being put in the middle of this client bullshit stuff. And that's just on the client side. On our side, we have nobody... They put a program manager in charge who has never run a program. This project is massive. There are eight scopes of work. Inside each scope, there are multiple work streams. The creative work stream alone has seven, or the creative scope alone has seven work streams. And this person has never run a program before at all. They also are trying to. I think I'm going to go ahead and end stream there. Um, so, but thank you for those who came and hung out for a little bit. Another proud moment. Um, I won't be streaming on Sunday because I will be missing my re usual raid static, but... Uh, and then I'll be out of town. So I actually probably will not be streaming until Sunday after this next one. Or, excuse me, Thursday after next will actually be sooner than Sunday after next. So, yeah. Anyways. Uh, where's my end screen? There it is. Thanks for watching. Bye.